Hello there, I am Janko with my Pokemon Leaf Green Redo. In the last part, we explored more Six Island. We may have got um, the Sapphire stolen from us because we found it first, but then a uh, scientist guy came and took it from us. I'm pretty sure that's what we did in the last part. It was all part of Six Island still, so here we are on the water path actually. I have trouble up front, so let's take on this, uh, I guess this is a Roman lady? So let's take her on. I let a pleasant breeze lead me all the way. I let a pleasant breeze lead me all the way here. Okay, cool. Yeah. And yeah, here's the one way. I think she has just grass type Pokemon, I guess. Sun Current. Okay. Yeah. So she's probably gonna have a Sun Current, of course, obviously, and also a um a Sun Four, possibly. Yeah. So Sun Current's level 49 and female. Let's see if a strength will take it on. Take it down, I guess, and it will. Awesome. And then here's a Sin 4. Cool. I raised a Sin 4 in my Pokemon Gold Walkthrough Guide. Made a good uh, Grass type Pokemon, even though the stats were kind of pretty bad. As I was told many times by uh, Matt Pissword. So, yeah. So he's Pell Dance on us now. Strength doesn't take it out all the way, but that's okay. It's level 4 9 in male. Okay, I was expecting that Pell Dance to do a little bit more, but that's okay. Let's go for the Shadow Ball, hopefully this will finish it off. And it does, awesome. Cool. We defeated Roma Lady Rose. You could call you so cute when you're determined. Okay, thanks. Thanks for $13.72. Rose, I guess. Okay. I think if you surf here, we'll just get an item. I might, I'm gonna put a pill on though, because I think I... Re I don't have a pill up actually. I don't think anything's. I don't have a pill that's lingering from the previous use of another pill. Okay, there we go. Yeah, okay. Yeah, I was right. Down to 34 max repels after this. Here, I forget what item this is. Oh, it's an Eox. They're cool. Very worth picking up. So it sucks yourself again. And yeah. That's pretty cool. Let's see here. Um. There's nothing over here. That could be a hidden item. It's like it's like screaming like hidden item right here. But I guess there might not be one, you know? Maybe I'm just if I use the item finder which I don't have it. <laughs> yeah. Oh well. Um we'll go into this house right here, I guess. It's um wanted the ultimate horn. Okay. Let's go inside. Hera, Hera, Heracross, big and shiny, it's the bug boss, love it, need it, Heracross. My like little song there. It's kinda cool. So over here is, um, just nothing. This also screams like item, I think there might be a berry over there to the, to the left, but I'm gonna see if there's an item over here. Jeez, okay. Uh, let's see, this is a berry. Uh, yes, it is. Orange berry. Cool. It'll store 10 HP of a Pokemon. And, uh, it'll be used, it can be used as a held item to, um, but I prefer citrus berry because it stores 20 more HP. I think this will say pattern bush. Yeah, green path, pattern bush ahead. Okay. Let's go inside it then. There's a lot of trainers in here, so that's pretty cool. And I think you can also catch a hair across and, uh, this area, so that's pretty cool. Heracross is a bug fighting type Pokemon, it's a really good Pokemon. It's four times weak to um, flying type Pokemon though, or flying type moves. But if you can get past that, it's a really good Pokemon still. I bet you think you're some guy, don't you, eh? Well, I'm supposedly this Pokemon League champion, but my rival just magically beats the G Elite Four after me again, after I win against him. And, uh, yeah. It doesn't, they don't give me a chance to like defend my title like in Sun and Moon, you know? Okay, as a far fetch level 40, let's go for the Thunderbolt. But yeah. So I'm pretty much a big hot shot, yeah. It's level 48 and male. And it goes down for the crit crit, awesome. There we go, nice. Far fetched, okay. Susan, oh yeah, okay, you have enough far fetched, okay, cool. Let's go for another Thunderbolt then. This one's also level 48 in male. Nice. Okay. Youngster uh, 
uh, Cordell or something, I don't know. I bet you think I'm weak, don't you, eh? No, I just think that you're unlucky with that battle. I just had a really good, powerful Pokemon. The next fist, $7.68, so. So, is it, uh, yeah. Use a screaming head item spots, too. <laughs> I'm curious, how do you raise your Pokemon? With love and trust. Yeah. Here's a breeder. Uh, Bethany, okay. She's a Chansey. Cool. It's level 50 and female, okay. Let's go for the strength on this thing. And yeah, this chance has a lot of HP. But yeah, it goes down one hit, awesome. Okay, yeah, triple cuff is in the level 63 now, cool. Play for you to Beth uh, breeder Bethany, okay. Pokemon breeder Bethany. You raise your Pokemon with love, with a whole lot of love. Yeah, you got that right. Thanks. Thanks for the $14 too. You'd think that there'd be a hidden item in here, but I guess not. Okay. Let's see here. Firefox can go up front, I guess. Here's a bug catcher. I caught a bug bug one that lives only around here. I'm guessing you caught a hair across then. <laughs> Here's bug catcher Garrett, okay. Yes, he only yeah, he caught a hair across. It's level 49, okay. Let's go with the flamethrower. See if this one hit kills it. And it will. Awesome. 2100 experience. Wow, that's pretty cool. He isn't my Pokemon awesome. Yes, it is awesome. Heracross is really cool. Thanks for $5.88. Let's see here. Uh, Let's see here. Is there an item right here? Nope, of course not. What about right here? Nope. What about right here? Nope. Ah, oh, dang, this is just weird. How's the effect off? No hit item there. Okay, let's put in the crawling. No hit item there either. Jeez. Let's take on this last right here. Okay, just talk to me. Just talk to me, jeez. Okay, I love Pokemon. I love bug Pokemon. That's why I, I'm here all the time. And I'm and I might only go like that. No, there's more Pokemon that goes like bug type Pokemon. Not the only one. Dang it! I bumped my microphone. I'm sorry. Jeez, I bumped my microphone with my hand. This is the last jo Joanna. Okay, Snubble level 49 female. Okay, cool. Um, let's go for the flamethrower. So this thing, to, let's hope we can take this out one hit, and we do. Nice. But Snowball's a normal type Pokemon, it's not even a bug type Pokemon. I lost, but I'm still laughing. Am I the only go like that? No, I guess there's others. I think it's for $7.84, man. Or, uh, Joanna, I guess. <laughs> Here's a youngster. Um, look, there are funny patterns on, patterns on the ground. Okay. That's cool. Here's youngster, um, Nash. He sends out a weeping bell, okay. Let's go for the fire blast, or not fire blast, but the flamethrower. So 47 and male, so this thing should go down one hit because it's super effective. And it does, awesome. Because Nash is in a weeping bell, okay, cool. Let's go for the flamethrower again. There we go, nice. Victory Bell, okay. Let's go for the flamethrower again. There we go, nice. Super awesome, thanks. Thanks for seven dollars and eighty four cents. Okay, I think I already checked there for him, iron, but uh, it was unlucky. Okay, let's see. Hold on. Wait, we're over here. There's another trainer, of course. He's a Roma lady. I'm working to preserve the natural uh, eco ecology of Pokemon here. That's pretty cool. 
And this is a, uh, okay, this is a breeder. Okay, it's spray looked like a, a Roma lady, honestly. Okay, she has a level 48, female, okay, that's female. Let's go for another flamethrower. Hopefully this can win it KO, that'd be nice. There we go, nice. Another Clefairy, okay. She might have two, two, two fairies in Clefairy, but that wouldn't surprise me, you know. Next, okay, this is uh, another Clefairy, level 48 and female. Okay, there we go, one to KO us again. That's nice. And Clefable, yeah, that's right, cool. So this Clefable is level 48 and female as well, but it's level all form of Clefairy. It looks like Clefairy's sprite there, Clefable sprite there. It's like, give me a hug. I want a big ol' hug. It's gonna use Metromom, so it could be like any move. Waste Kick, Flash Fire, raised its power, firepower though. Dang it, yeah, it stinks to be you right now. Let's just go for another flamethrower. Should knock it out. There we go. You should Pokemon Breeder Allison, okay. Oh, for someone so young, you are tremendous. Thanks. Thanks for thirteen dollars and four four cents too, Allison. Appreciate it. Um, did I forget? Did um, no, Firefox is not level up, but it's close to leveling up though. Let's take on this camper. It could be the camper or, or a um, picket truck. I didn't see the front of her face or the front of his face. Either one. Um, this is a good spot. I pitched my tent here. Okay, so I'm guessing you're a camper. Then, yeah, you're a camper. Okay. This is Camper Riley. Okay, he has a pincer, okay. Level 49, male. It's male. Okay, yeah, let's go for the flamethrower. This is gonna be super effective, so hopefully we can take this now in one hit. That'd be nice. And we do, awesome. Yeah, Firefox in level 63, awesome. Hair across. Oh, let's go to Airbender now, huh? Because flying time moves are four times weak to. Uh, four times super effective against uh, Heracross because it's bug and fighting type. So yeah, let's go for the wing attack. It's level 50 in male, okay. But it goes out in one hit, nice. Because they have the type advantage, really. There we go. We defeat the Camper Riley. Uh, wimped out. Sorry, man. Thanks for the $10, though. Okay, so let's put, um,. Airbender up front and then switch Firefox with um Starman and we should be good, good to, we should be good, good to go. Okay, let's see, is this a hidden item spot? Nope, of course not. What about here? Nope. Over here, nope. And uh here. Nope, okay, let's talk to you. You know it just doesn't feel right if I don't use bug book one. Well you're a bug catcher, of course it doesn't feel right. Jeez, okay, let's this is bug catcher Joe. Jonah. Okay, yeah, it's, he's in, he has the Yanma level 45 and it's male. Let's go for the wing attack on this thing. It's gonna use the detect, of course, to protect itself. Okay, that's cool, I guess. It's gonna, oh yeah, it's a, it also has speed boost. After every turn, it's ability speed boost, so after every turn, it raises its speed. So you gotta knock this thing out first before it lands its uh, attack on us, you know? And that's what we do, awesome. Yeah, there we go. I wasn't worried about fainting, you know, Airbender, but like. Yanma with that speed boost is kind of just annoying. It's kind of annoying. So, because this Yanma is level 46, it's male. Probably has the speed boost ability. It's going to use detect like the last one and then go feast. It raises its speed because it's speed boost again. Yeah, there we go. I knew it. I knew it. I knew it. I knew it. Let's go for the one attack. Hopefully, it'll faint it this time. And it does. Oh, could quit. Awesome. Okay. Beedrill, okay. He has one more Pokemon after this. It could be a Butterfree as his final Pokemon. Let's go for the Wing Attack gate on Speedrill. It's level 45 and male. But hopefully this thing takes it on one hit. Awesome, it does. Oh, there we go. And oh, he has two Beedrills and two Yanmas then, okay. I was expecting him to like get Butterfree or something, you know? Let's go for the be uh, Let's go for the Wing Attack again. Speedrill's level 47 in male, it takes it out in one hit, awesome, nice. 
Okay, we defeat by Catcher Jonah. Okay, it's okay. Losing is part of Pokemon's appeal, too. Thanks for being so understanding. Thanks for $5.64, too. Because the only one I didn't battle, I think, is yeah, this the last I haven't battled yet. Take a deep breath, isn't there delicious? I guess so, but I don't really want to taste there right now, to be honest. Here's the last, uh, Dahlia, Dahlia. Yeah, here's a hop it. It's, uh, grass and flying type, so, like, ice type moves are four times weak to, uh, four times super effective, my bad. Uh, to hop it and skip boom and jump off. Okay, so she might have a skip boom and a jump off, actually. I wouldn't be surprised now, actually. Oh, she's just another hop it, okay. Maybe she, after that, she has a jump off and a, um, skip boom. You never know. This hop it's level 47 and female, okay. Because down one wing attack, though. Yeah, there we go. Now Evander is level 63. Awesome. Skip him. Okay. We'll switch to uh, Starman then. Evander's level 63, but Starman. Okay, yeah. Skip him. Let's use a, a Ice Beam on this thing because it's going to be four times super effective. Because again, it's grass and, you know, flying type. The scoop is level 47 and female, but it goes down one hit with the ice beam because of the type of range, I guess. That's awesome. And okay, she, I thought she would have a dump, jump off, but um, she has a, another skip boom instead. This skip boom is level 48 and female. Let's go for another ice beam. Hopefully, we can take this out in one hit. I'm hoping, I'm hoping, I'm hoping. And we do. Awesome. Nice. If you like, I can teach you how to breathe properly. Thanks. <laughs> but, um, no thanks. I'll just continue on with my journey, I guess. Thanks for offer, though. Thanks for the $7.68, too. Okay. No hit, I'm there. No hit, I'm there. No hit, I'm there. What about right here? Oh, there's a picnic right there, actually. Let's take her off. No, I actually have to switch to, um, uh, Starman first. Almost forgot. Is a picnicker, and she says, "Oh yuck! I think a big a bug stung me. That's not fun." Picnicker, Marcy, like the battle, of course. Paris, okay. Let's go for a ice beam, I guess. Could be super effective because it's um grass and bug, but I just want to make sure it is super effective. Awesome. Cool. I was doubting myself there with the type matchup. Another Paris. Okay, she, she might have two Paris. And, well, she does have two Paris. But she might have two Paris and a Paris sect. Let's go for the Ice Beam again. It's all 40 in female, so it's pretty cool. It goes out in one hit. Awesome and super effective hit, nonetheless. Yeah. Paris sect, I was right. Cool. So her Paris sect is level 49 in female. Let's for this Ice Beam again. It'll be super effective, which is nice. Let's see if we can take out one hit. And we do. Nice. There we go. We feed Picnicker and Marcy. I was, it wasn't a bug. I cut my sh 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 shin on some grass. Aw, oh, sorry to hear that. Thanks for $9.08, though. Poor Marcy. I hope you get better. <laughs> you know, that sucks. Okay, let's see. Here's a... Oh, is there a hammer right here? Nope, I guess not. Here's a hiker. He's kind of out of place for this area, though. Have you noticed something odd about these parts? Maybe a little bit. I don't know. Oh, this is a Rune Maniac. My bad. Okay, so he's a Sand Slash. Cool. So 48 in male. Cool. Let's go for the Surf on this thing. And let's see if it one kills it. Yes, it is. Awesome. The sun slash goes down. Onyx. Okay. Let's choose waterfall on this Onyx. It's level 48 in male. Let's go for the waterfall. There we go. And it one kills it. Awesome. And another sun slash. Okay. Let's go for another surf on this thing then. This one's also level 40 in male, just like the last one. And it goes down one hit, awesome. 
defeated Rune Maniac, Rune Maniac uh, Waiten. Have you taken a good look around your feet? <laughs> I guess, I guess not. No. Thanks for twenty-three dollars and four cents, though. Here's another. Here's um a bug catcher. I guess I'll go back around and see us. There we go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Look at all the bug Pokemon. This might be the last Pokemon battle of the video, though, of the part. Here's bug catcher um Vance. He's two Pokemon. He has a Venona. Okay, cool. Let's go for the Surf on this thing. It hits, awesome. It's level 40 in male. And it goes down one hit, awesome. I'm guessing it's a Venomoth as a second and final Pokemon. Yes, I was right, cool. Nice. Because it's level 40 in male. Let's go for the Surf on this thing. There we go, nice. Yeah, but cut your vans. Okay, cool. I got beat while I was still um, busy celebrating. Aw oh, man, what are you celebrating, man? I wanted in on it. <laughs> like for five dollars and sixty uh seventy six cents. So, yeah, I'm here. I think I may have battled everyone now. Battle you, battle you. I battle you, right, the youngster? Okay, yeah. Um what else? Who else I should say? Pulse effective off. Let's put another pill on. I think I battled everyone. Bowed you. Bowed you. You're not the only girl who likes collecting bug Pokemon. Okay, I think I may have battled everyone in the pattern bush right now, so that's good. Bowed you. Bowed you. Bowed you, right? Yeah, I did. Okay. Cool. Bow this room maniac. We just bowed you. I think I bowed everyone in the pattern bush except for. Oh, okay, I care about you too. Let's go on to the next area then. Here's the green path. Guess we can surf, I guess. But yeah, I'm gonna end the part right here actually. Spin on my Pokemon Leaf Green Redo Walk the Walk the Get part. The next part will take on more of the green path and more of the surfing area. I think we make it back to um the well let's check our map actually. We are right here on the map. Of, yeah, there we go. Green path. We can surf on here to Alkest Island. And then uh, we can go to the alternating cave, which I think was for an event. For a certain Pokemon. So that's pretty cool. For like a mystery gift event or something. And yeah. So yeah, so this has been my Pokemon Leaf Green video walk through part. Next part will do just that. So this has been Dragon Go again. I would like to thank for again. Goodbye. And I hope to see you guys explore my Pokemon Leaf Green video walk through guide.